he was still being aggro. So things like right. uh, immediate up air out of shield I see from this character a lot. Short hop up for air, sure. and it's very safe, extremely difficult for, for other people to punish. And Ritzko's Bayonetta is extremely strong from my own personal experience okay. as well. I mean, this is one of the worst matchups among the top tiers in the game. Uh, Sonic having a really rough time getting around Bayo's tools. And Bayonetta, I mean, as a character, she has amazing attacks. So her, her, her grab game is not amazing. Her throw game is not amazing. But her attacks are just so oppressive. And because of that witch time, she has an amazing answer against your attacks. Especially at Spin Dash. Exactly. And um, that's exactly what it's I was taking, what? talking about. Because Sonic as a character is much the same. Um, he's not much of, a, of an out-of-shield character. He's not much of a grab character, though he does have a few good confirms. He really likes to oppress you with his Spin Dash. So in a matchup like this, we, can, we, we see a lot of uh, interactions based on what attack beats what attack. Yeah. And as we saw right there, the spring not really being a very effective tool at edge guard oh, no. and Bayonetta, not which is going to go right through that. We're seeing Rixo push towards the left-hand side of the screen. Pelly, like I said, in that way, is in that sort of passive way, is more than happy just to move back towards the center of the stage and yep. give up a bit of stage control in a way that he can set up his offense and set up his approach from distance again. Pelly is definitely capitalizing on his burst range. Yes. And, and, and when you enter Sonic's burst range, which, to be fair, you enter fairly quickly, yes. um, you are often forced to make some sort of decision about how you are going to play around his burst range option, which is often spin dash, right? But it can also be run up up air, to be fair, but it's often spin dash. And when you do make that decision, that is when Sonic can actually decide to not go for that spin dash and capitalize on your counterplay. So, sorry, suddenly that forward throw from Peli killing at 174 <laughs> from center stage. Really good DI from Rixo, but not quite enough to rescue Wasn't his enough, stuff. No. And there we see that, that short hop up air as an approaching tool. And he's being taken for a ride off the top platform. I get a feeling he was watching out for the spring right there. But it <laughs> didn't come out from Peli. Peli didn't give it to him. He was ready. I think he was ready to maybe pull trigger on the witch time. Yeah, Rixo is looking not, not a great position right now. And that's especially a thing versus Sonic. Being behind in percent, let alone a stock. It's such a big deal because it changes the dynamic of the of the matchup oh. so much. Wow, that was hard. That was an extremely hard example of uh, spacing fundamentals right there. <laughs> oh, sorry, you tried to make a read on a roll in. Well, let me stand right out of that range and hit you with a bigger fist. Yeah, Rick, though, definitely <laughs> showing that you got to pay 5.99 to increase those hitboxes, right? That big fist. Coming in clutch, but not enough to kill Pelly. Battlefield is a huge stage, and Rixo has not racked up enough percents quite yet. The slow falling dare. I always hate it when that move comes out against me, but virtually never comes out by our intention. In this case, though, Pelly putting up so much of a fight on this first stock of his. Rixo, however, as I say that, he evens up the stock count, and that means that anything is possible at this point. Absolutely. Sonic is very susceptible to combos due to his weight, due, due to his size, due to his fall speed. It all just kind of adds up to become a very easy combo target. But in that case, the, he the, is going to get the confirm into the back air. The spin dash confirm into back air there, coming through for Peli. Uh, he's, he's got that one down like breathing. You get, as you he let should him, be yes. as a Sonic main. Yes. If, you, if, you, if, you, if you whiff a move and get hit with that, just he will just change direction, spin dash you, jump back air, and it will, just, it will be the end of your stop. And Peli showing us how, how well practiced he is. And let's see what Rixo has to show here, because I think he's a Falcon main. Yeah, there it is. There it is. So I imagine most Falcons would pick a secondary for the Sonic matchup because that's not a fun look. Uh, Falcon very much reliant on, on hard approaches. It's kind of running into your face, uh, getting a lot of mileage out of that dash grab. Uh, but versus Sonic versus a spin dash, this is not going to work out. And we even saw Pelly beat Fatality, Fatality just a few months ago. He knows this matchup. Uh, he knows this matchup, but Rickstro, at this point, he doesn't have much of a choice. The Bayo just simply did not work out. But however, Rickstro just came straight down off the platform and said, listen, here's a, here's, here's a gentleman. This is, how, this is what my neutral looks like from exactly. now on. Exactly. I'm going to be holding jab every time you're near me. Oh, the grab on the top platform, and that is going to be... An early stock for Rick, though. <laughs> it, was, um, it was not the best idea to go up there and get, get grabbed. It was really. definitely not the best idea. Belly without a jump, though. Almost getting spiked. Rick, though, just off a little bit. 
Rixo was looking super desperate for a second there, though. This is where this is where things start to fall apart when you're losing against Sonic. You to be fair, he needed to have that spike, and he yes. was in a good position to make it happen. Sonic did not have that double jump. That was probably his best attempt at making the comeback happen, and now he just needs to kind of cruise and maybe play defensively, try to wait until another one of those opportunities arrives. Because forcing it there is, it is not what you want to do versus yeah. Sonic. Look at that, Rixto showing Pally what's up. Yeah, Un our own character. Okay, wow. okay. Well, I mean, that's a thing. Oh, that's that also <laughs> a thing. Pelly so Rixto did so well to force Pelly into panicking and and giving him the air dodge yeah, that he for wanted, sure. and then immediately gave up the neutral and got taken to the top so quickly once again by Pelly. I, it's it's that mindset.